Okay, I brought some props to uh, go with my speech, you know, I just thought it would uh, be a little bit more interactive if I did it that way. Okay, so uh, one of the first yeah, dates okay. that uh, me and Ariel ever went on was a 14k <laughs> ride through the forks of the Dawn, which is where the east and west tributaries of the Dawn unite. Gosh, could there be a more symbolic setting for the coming together of two individuals? Oh, 14 oh, F and K. Oh, oh, oh. Now he's proposing, guys. <laughs> Everyone <laughs> 14 F and K. That's no walk in the park. What course it is it? It's a gigantic run. Bottom line, it's hard work. You really gotta want it. And I'm sure that Ariel has always been a phenomenal runner. Come on, Ariel Figal. You guys all know how awesome she is at life. <laughs> but it's fair to say that 14k right off the bat is a bold move that not too many of us could pull off. I think Ariel showed us something that day. If you're not willing to run 14k for some guy that you're kind of into, maybe he's not worth it. <laughs> but there's actually two parts to this story. Uh, it was like close to the end of the run, we were both thirsty, we didn't have any water on us. Uh, I got this what random, <laughs> yeah. uh, I got this random energy boost, so I used seeing bolted ahead. I ran to the end. I ran to the end and I started running back toward Ariel, but not before I did something really awesome. I ran up to a group of guys by a car and I broke it down for them. I was like, look, I'm with this really, I'm with this really awesome girl. It's a first date. She needs some water, and if you gave me a bottle, it'd make me look really good in front of her. They looked at me with these accusing eyes. And with these accusing eyes and confused countenances. <laughs> so <laughs> close up. This is a close up right here. How long were you running? Some what? Come on. Hey, hey. They looked at me with these. <laughs> they looked at me with these accusing eyes and confused countenances. Some what? Can we get it? I can't say water of the North American way. Shit. Just give me some heavy oil. <laughs> well, anyways, they gave me a bottle. Heavy I, I think this, uh, I think this, uh, actually was something. If you're not willing to go up to a uh, group of grand, if you're not willing to go up to a group of random guys by a car, and ask for some water for the girl you're running with so that you can look more like a hero in front of her? No, we can be a little bit more general here. If you're not willing to experience a little bit of discomfort for that other person's benefit, so that, uh, or if you don't feel this urge inside you, yo, wait, can you like chill with that? <laughs> you don't feel this urge inside you to want to impress them, to want to help them, to want to be a hero, then either they're not worth it or you're not. It's fair to say that Ariel is definitely worth it. Yeah. 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 So, to remember, so to remember old times, I got that from some random people outside. But as cute, I'm totally redeeming myself on this one. Okay, as cute as that running story is, I'm sorry you guys had to listen to that merging of two hearts, merging of two rivers, merging of two hearts, excessively sentimental anecdote. That's not, that's not actually the entire point of my speech. I want to focus on a different bottle. Uh, oh, oh my god! Uh, Stop get it. some! No! Get some! Yo, is yes! Is there any of And I'm gonna prove my point right now. 26 ounces, 26 years in. Each ounce is a year of our lives, and making it to 26 means we're about to finish the bottle. Well what, is, well, what does that mean? Well, first of all, this bottle is a polysemic symbol. It stands for lots of things. It's not just an emblem for alcohol <laughs> overload. It's also a badge for outgoingness, and the social glue which unites classmates, friends, sports teams, and even random strangers who show up on your softball team unannounced. But aren't you guys so glad I did? So many parties and pre-drinks were expected to show up with one of these. It was an extension of our arm. Sharing shots was a handshake. At the very least, it was a VIP pass into any social event. Oh. But at the end of the day, to all the beer drinkers in the room, F off, you're ruining my metaphor. <laughs> but uh, at the end of the day, this 2-6 is also a timeline. Emblematic of the years we've lived through, and by finishing it off, the past we're leaving behind, and the era we are entering into. Childhood, oh, that was so great. Yeah. Teenagehood, even better. Young adulthood, uh, starting to get responsibilities and real jobs, but still awesome. <laughs> Tons of memories associated with each age. Not to mention, these are some tough acts to follow. 
I know that Ariel has cherished her, uh, cherished her years to the fullest and maximized her potential. She's built friendships, accomplished worthy achievements, and distinguished herself as a fully capable and self-sufficient adult. Ariel, you should totally be proud of yourself. Yes, you should. Oh, but you should. But you've turned 26. It's time to finish this last ounce. This isn't just another speech to, commemor to commemorate a birthday party. This, this is an ovation to finish the bottle. Congratulations. And on that note, uh, this is an ovation to finishing the bottle. Congratulations. Finish it. Finish One it. more ounce for many oh, more ounces it. to come. Finish it. Great day. Okay. Yeah, thanks for that. Yeah, thanks for that. <laughs> <laughs> well, once that happens, then what? You're left with the empty bottle. What do you do with it? Are you sad that it's over? Do you return it for 20 cents? Okay, you, wait. Do you put it on a shelf? Do you put it back up on a shelf? Any good Jew returns it for 20 cents. Shut up! It's almost done. Come on. Do you put it up on a shelf? The momentum of good days passed. Do you want to know what I think we should do with it? We should do as we do with all achievements. Recognize the small victory, cherish the merit, and move on to the next one. Yeah. 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 yeah! So, so here's the next one. Drink a shawl every year until you're 52. Yeah. 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 Do, whatever you, do whatever you want with it, but recognize you're on to the next bottle. My mama most definitely did not say this to me, but life is like a bottle of vodka. <laughs> Enjoy it until it's gone. So on that note, let's make a toast to sum okay. this whole thing up. Uh, to Ariel! Oh, to Ariel! May you live out your highest vision in the context of love and joy. <laughs> and may tonight be worthy of this final ounce. I think you have a bottle to finish off. To finish the bottle. This guy needs a drink! Yeah. <laughs> Ariel, finish the bottle. Ariel! Are you going to be able to do it? Number 26! Number 26! Number 26, Ariel! <laughs> I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. 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 I'm